Hello fellow spacefarers, Rocket here. I decided to start recording the episode early, even though they are not done building the hull entirely, because we were given some very interesting trade opportunities, like buying fibers and then turning them into fabrics and selling them back, and then second ship entered, and also we were selling fabrics and get another tech block. But welcome back to kind of part two of my starting guide, featuring ship design today and as well being part two of my alpha 14 let's play series with brutal difficulty of course you could design ships any shape and form you'd like here an attempt of me creating the battlestar galactica which i scrapped for it really lacks the third dimension and the dimensions were off design is a study of its own regarding the appliance of phi the golden ratio and all that stuff personally as a min maxer i go by form follows function so we are going to talk more about how to create a good ship in space haven but if you are interested in building something aesthetically pleasing then my first tip would be to choose an odd width or length depending on your alignment axes and if you want to incorporate rounded more organic looking shapes there is a great website out there for creating voxel shapes which you can find in the description of course i'm limiting the logistics to those just because when we depart we don't leave any blocks in those back we need to take care about not leaving any stuff behind all right so franklin is finishing the airlock this means now we can put stuff where we want it let's talk about hull stabilizers so those provide your ship points you definitely want to have as much ship points as possible but bug bite prevents us from spamming those by giving them this area meaning you must not put two of them too close to each other so you need to design your ship to accommodate for this the prevention area is about 13 of those tiles meaning the other one would be on this end probably the next one could be over here and the next one then over here so for a 3x2 ship means that i can fit six in here you could just build your ship by you know using all the space here but also consider that the ship size triggers a diminishing return on the hull stabilizer's ability to generate hit points for your ship so building ship with shapes is encouraged now i'm just quickly putting together what we are definitely going to need for our starting ship and then we are going to look further when they are done building that just notice that we cannot finalize the entire ship setup because placing a big power node also requires the hull stabilizer to be operational already we need to do it in two shifts regarding power this is pretty interesting now they are both costing just one power block this just requires two system points but has double the range and triple the capacity so yeah all right since we have our research lab i would like starting research in power capacity node yes please interesting so total we have still three tech blocks question is what are we going to use them for we have enough water for now and here is also ice in the system that's three that's one let's build that one mm, nope that's not gonna work that could work let's do that so as you saw i just manually put in fruits and nuts because of our settings here so we will keep the logistics stopped now because they are going to empty this i've been uh, stopping all the oxygen generators from getting more water except of this one so we are slowly emptying the station of oxygen this is just going to receive one more water and then we are stopping the logistics here as well because we are not going to stay here forever also going to stop putting more energy rods in here as well because we are not going to need all this power anymore we could stop that we can't stop this we can't stop this all right now we are starting transferring and then also mining everything there we go 
Let's quickly check how is the station doing. O2 is fine. Yeah, we just ran out. Kitchen. Yeah, we probably should eat here once more. <laughs> but I doubt there is enough to transport over there anymore. Well, we'll we'll see. Rule of thumb: furniture comes last. So last night here on the station, then I guess uh, oxygen is going to drop really low for moving the last stuff over there. Yeah, you've run out of that. That's cool. So you you guys are going to empty that thing. Perfect. Love it. Okay, it looks like we are nearly done. Good. Then let's put it that way. Awesome. Kitchen is empty now, right? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> we are done. Okay, everybody's having breakfast. Oh, let's do our first jump. Then I really like that the drives are spooling up slower than the operator does. Well, it's a good and a bad thing at the same time. A good thing because stuff's not going to get away as easy. Bad thing, we are not going to get away as easy. <laughs> Jump. Okay, let's see what do we... Oh, a station. Let's drop there. Okay, so what do we have? Oh, that's the mother load. Exactly what we need. We can buy four. Perfect. And we could buy one more of those. And we could sell five of those. Yeah, it doesn't make sense to sell more. But then let's grab another of those two more of those because those are super cheap here because they have 15 of them so yeah we are hardly getting a better price anywhere else in the galaxy yeah i accept that's cool <laughs> right let's mine that thing all right that's really cool so that thing's going to get finished then we are going to build our research lab uh no hold on a sec that's costing two, that's costing one. So let's do it that away. And then let's put that thing here as well. There are our tech blocks coming. Love it. Oh, we are low on infra blocks. <laughs> How did that happen? <laughs> All right, let's prepare for another jump. Girl, you need to get your priorities straight. Like, seriously. Cool thing is, this entire room is right next to those chairs. So they don't need to walk long distances. Ready. Jump. Let's see. There's a lot of stuff. Hello. What's that? Is that a station? Yeah, that's a station. Let's trade with the ship first. Or did we do that already? Ah, uh, yeah, looks like we did. That we bought our first block from. Okay, let's trade with the station then. Oh, you got those on sale. Hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, so let's sell you one of these. Like three of those. Let's get two of those. And they got all, all those goodies. Could we sell something else? You got plates? No, you don't. Let's sell one of these. And then let's get one of those and one of these. Yeah, that looks decent. And then let's mine all that stuff. Oh, and you, you please refine as soon as we have less than three, five order. What's the schedule today? Half day. All right, so we could still like go on a derelict mission or something. Is there something around? Up here, great. Ah, small little thing. That was an awesome start. Like first we were able to, you know, trade and then get these and sell them. That was awesome. And now we like, instantly filled up with tech and energy blocks so now all we need to do is like salvage that thing and we get enough soft and infra and more hull and that's perfect hello 
Anybody here? Doesn't look like it. More credits. Oh wait, there is more. Yeah, there we go. So we got a new data log. Okay. They call me crazy. I like that. Yeah. Perfect. Undraft you guys. Undraft that thing. Transfer. Perfect. Yeah, taking it. And then we want all the energy. All the tech, all the infra, all the soft, all the hull. That was easy, right? <laughs> awesome. Yes, thank you. Awesome. <laughs> Probably a good point to end this episode. Thanks for watching, guys. Please leave a like if you liked it. And we see each other next time. Bye, guys.